Hi everyone, I thought I would do a little blog post or vlog post with tips for spring gardening. First of all, with any kind of seasonal gardening, you want to pick to plant the right crops for the season. So in the spring, I'm in North Carolina, depending on what state or country you're in, most spring vegetables would be things like broccoli, carrots, bok choy, mitsuna, lettuce, Michelin mix, um, Brussels sprouts, spinach, uh, arugula, cilantro or coriander to the Brits. Um, I'm trying to think if I've missed anything. I've planted some fava beans. You could also plant some strawberries to be ready to be in bloom for May, June. That's when our strawberries ripen here. So first, Tip one, plant the right vegetables for the season. Don't be too eager. We often get a few really hot days in the, this region, and then we'll get a few nighttime temperatures in the 30s, which happened a couple of nights ago, and we're gonna get a couple this week. So don't be too eager and start planting fresh basil, tomatoes, and summer vegetables. Go ahead, buy the transplants, I have a few. I always buy tomatoes and peppers as transplants, they do much better, it's tricky to grow them from seed. I'm watering them but I'm keeping them in my garage, bringing them out in the daytime to give them sunlight but I'm just waiting till there's no risk of frost. So normally about April 15th, so we're very close now but do check ahead for those nighttime temperatures. However, don't worry, if we have some low temperatures Row covers are very inexpensive. Even little sell them very cheaply. You can get them on Amazon. And just watch the weather, cover at night, or you could use old bed sheets, uh, tea towels. That will work just fine. So, tip two is check those nighttime temperatures. Also, you want to have good soil. Um, I often just uh, buy garden soil or raised bed soil for my local farm supply store and every time I plant I add some fresh soil or I make some leaf mulch or you can make some compost and add that and just watch the plants. The plants will tell you if they're thriving. If they're growing and they're green and they're producing food for you, your soil is fine. So don't worry too much about that. Bugs are pretty much always going to be an issue. <laughs> especially if you're not using any sprays, keep on top of them, pick them off. And you may tolerate a few holes here and there and it will still taste good. Watch for those white uh, cabbage moths. They love basilica plants like cabbage and um, cabbage, uh, broccoli, cauliflower, and they will land Swiss chard and lay eggs and the caterpillars will eat it all up so just keep an eye you could use netting to prevent that so tip three was keep your eyes open for bugs and then as the season starts to get towards summer you can start adding other things like tomatoes and peppers eggplant and other things and you can slowly transition over as it starts getting warmer hope that was helpful feel free to ask me questions below